<laughs> All right, now I want to talk about our weather. Hopefully, we are on a winning streak. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. Well, I think it's a win if we don't have to shovel the S N O W that may be coming our way, Felicia. I love how she spells it. I don't like <laughs> to say it. I don't like We're not going to say it. I know. Are you going to say it, Felicia? It's the dreaded snow word. I know. I, yeah. yeah. I, I I have to say. I mean, that's kind of my job. I can't I can't keep avoiding that word, especially in the winter season. But temperatures are feeling very much like winter. We have them in the 30s. We have 30 in Oakland, 31 in Washington. It is much cooler compared to this time yesterday morning where we were waking up in the 40s. Now they're in the 30s, so we need to dress warm as you're stepping out the door. But we don't have to worry about any kind of rain and there's no fog. So two thumbs up compared to yesterday morning. The only trade off is that it's a little bit cooler, but it's like December. So 35 degrees is what we have in Pittsburgh at the moment. Thankfully, we have a calm wind. We don't really want much of a wind because then it feels a lot colder. Later this afternoon, highs will be topping off in the low 40s, but still feeling like the 30s for the most part since those winds will pick up from time to time. But Futurecast does have a chance for some showers moving in after sunset. Now it's indicating that this one particular model is showing it's going to be an all snow. However, some of the other models are saying, hey, we could see more of a rain snow mixture. That's more likely for the lower elevations. Now, if you're in the higher elevations, this is going to be mainly a snow event. But by tomorrow morning, we all should see snow showers since temperatures will be around freezing and we'll start to see some of that snow pile up tomorrow morning heading into the afternoon, but it should taper off by nighttime leading into Sunday. New Year's Eve starting off dry and we're going to watch for some light snow showers rolling through and we could pick up some accumulations in the laurels and ridges. Not too much around Pittsburgh, maybe a slight coating for Saturday, but that's probably about it. And we're not looking at too much snow for New Year's Eve, just light snow enough to really decorate the sky, but it will be very chilly. So if you're outside, doing any of those New Year's Eve plans, dress warm in a few extra layers, especially if doing anything around midnight. Temperatures around then as we're ringing in 2024 will be around 34 degrees. Leading into New Year's Day on Monday, we still could have some leftover flurries. High temperatures will be in the upper 30s, but that's pretty normal for New Year's Day. So there are some different kinds of precipitation scattered over the next several days. Today, it's mainly just rain to snow showers and then tomorrow we could see that mixture Sunday Monday we are leading into mainly just snow chances and tomorrow will be probably the most impactful weather day I would say but it's not gonna be a high impact day we're gonna watch for those snow showers especially in the morning turning to more of a rain snow mixture by the afternoon so tonight we're looking at the rain and snow moving in after sunset, so during the day we're dry, and that'll last into tonight, switching over into snow by tomorrow morning. And we're still hanging out with highs around 40 degrees really over the next several days, and we're ringing in the new year with a chance for light snow. And then we're drying out for Tuesday and Wednesday.